Hey, my first grade friends, let's get ready for foundations. The materials you need at home are index cards, a red crayon, a notebook, and a pencil. Materials you will need at school are index cards, a red crayon, your dry erase board and marker, and your tile boards. Today's objective is I can identify digraph blends. We are learning three new trick words this week. So let's get those index cards and our red crayons ready to write the word her. The next trick word we are learning this week is over. And the next, this is a long one, this is number. How can you use the words her, over, or number in a sentence? Please discuss with your teachers or a parent. Now let's get ready to echo. Remember, when you see Echo the Owl, you repeat after me. A, apple, a. B, bat, b. C, cat, k. D, dog, d. E, ed, e. F, fun, G, game, G, H, hat, I, itch, I, J, jug, J, K, kite, L, lamp, U. M, man, M. Mm. N, nut, N. Mm. O, octopus, A. Ah. P, pan, P. Q, U, queen, Qu. R, rat, er. S, snake, s. T, top, t. U, up, a. Uh. V, van, v. W, wind, w. X, fox, x. Y, yellow, y. Z, zebra, z. W, H, whistle, w. C, H, chin, ch. S, H, ship, sh. Th thumb ck sock all ball all am ham am an fan an s bugs A N G Fang Ang I N G Ring Ing O N G Song Ong U N G Lung Ung A N K Bank Ank I N K Pink ink. O N K honk onk. U N K junk onk.
A R car R. O R horn or. Now pause the video and stretch your vowel sounds out. Remember, we have different sounds and different kinds of letters in our alphabet. So we have vowel letters, A, E, I, O, U, and we have consonant letters. So all the letters that are not A, E, I, O, and U are consonant letters. So last week we were learning about consonant blends, and we learned about two consonant letters next to each other was considered a blend. Well, now this week we are going to learn digraph blends. So this time it's a blend that has a digraph with it. So you'll see three consonants in a row. So these words have four sounds. Lunch, l, a, n, ch, lunch, and shrub, sh, r, a, b, shrub. But the N and the CH and lunch blend together to make a nice smooth sound. The same thing with SH and R. They blend together to make a nice smooth sound. So we mark our digraph blends just like we always have. We mark the blending sound, the blending consonant, with an underline, and then we underline the whole digraph so that does not change. So when you're marking the word lunch, you're gonna underline the N, then underline CH together. Same thing with shrub. You're gonna underline SH together and then underline the R by itself. That shows it is a blend. We are going to also learn three new R-controlled vowels. Now, these R-controlled vowels are kind of tricky because they all sound the same, okay? But as we read more and more and we see words in everyday things, we'll start to learn when we need to learn each sound and when we need to spell each sound, okay? So repeat after me. You're going to echo. E R her er i r bird er you are burn er see they all make the same sound so again as we are learning to read and we are reading more and more we will learn when we need to use each er sound Now this is our word of the day, shred. How do we tap out the word shred? Hands up, sh, r, e, d, shred. Good, how many letters in the word shred? That is five letters, but how many sounds? Right, four sounds, because remember SH together on one card makes one sound. How can we write it on the writing grid? Well, this is the word shred when we write it on our lines. So if you have a notebook or your dry erase board, this is what it should look like. And how do we mark it? Remember, a digraph blend shows an underline under SH because we always underline our digraphs. And then the R will be underlined by itself. That shows that is a digraph blend. What is the vowel sound? Good. Eh. That is our vowel sound. And what does the word shred mean? Shred means to tear apart. You can shred paper, you can shred food, okay? Now we need our tile boards or our notebooks. Remember, if you're at home, you can use a notebook. If you're in school, you need your tile board. So we are going to spell some words together. We're gonna spell a lot of digraph blend words, okay? So you need to pay, pay close attention. So I'm going to say the word in a sentence, say the word again, then I would like you to echo the word. Ready? This is a bunch of bananas. Bunch. Okay, now spell the word bunch.
This is what the word bunch looks like. Okay, now we're going to clear our boards and we're going to write another word. Now, if you're writing in your notebook, you can just go to the next line and write the word. Are you ready? When you do not know the answer to something, you might show that with your body with a shrug. Shrug. This is what shrug looks like. Okay, next line, clear your boards. Careful, the crabs on the beach might pinch you. Pinch. This is what pinch looks like. Good. And last, put the book back on the shelf. Shelf. And this is what shelf looks like. Now you're going to try Digraph Blends on your own. Have a great day.